Welcome everyone, Math with Chris. Let's take a look at the number 72. We're going to find the factors of 72 using a factor tree. Uh, 72 has a bunch, so there's going to be quite a few steps here. Uh, first thing we always do is bank the two easiest factors. That's 1 and the number itself, 72. Now, let's see, we're going to break down 72 into, we've got to find two numbers that multiply together to give us 72. Uh, a couple different options. I'm going to go with uh, 8 times 9. Let's take a look at the 8 first. 8 can be broken down further, not a prime number, so let's break it down to 2 times 4. Uh, 2 is a prime number, circle the 2. And 4 is, of course, 2 more 2's, so 2 times 2, circle both of those 2's. The left side is done, we have 3 2's there. Now let's go over to the right side, take a look at the 9. Uh, 9 we can break down into 3 times 3, that's our only option. And 3's are prime numbers, so 3's are done. Circle both of the 3's. And as you can see, our factor tree is done as any branch you take uh, ends up in a, uh, any path you go with ends in a circled prime number. So our prime factors of 72, we have a 2, a 2, a 2, a 3, and a 3. Three twos and two threes. Let's multiply those out here. 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 3. If you uh, go ahead and multiply those out, you'll see those do indeed equal 72. So let's bank the prime numbers we found. We found 2 and 3. Those are the only prime numbers that are factors of 72. Uh, and any number we hit along the way down this, down this path also get banked. We have an 8, we have a 9, and we also hit a 4. So 8, 9, and 4 all get banked. 8, 9, and 4. Now the last thing we do is we come down here and we got to try combinations of numbers that uh, try combinations of these numbers to see if they multiply together to give us something that hasn't been banked yet. Uh, let's try a couple things. 2 times 2, we already got a 4. What about 2 times 3? 2 times 3 is 6. We don't have 6 yet, so let's put 6 in there. What about uh, 3 times 3? 3 times 3 is 9. We, we already got that. So we are almost done, but we also have to try the 3 and 4-way combos. Uh, so let's try 2 times 2 times 2. 2 times 2 times 2 is 8. Already got that. What about 2 times 2 times 3? 2 times 2 times 3 is 12. We don't have that yet. Let's bank the 12. Uh, what are the three-way combos? Are there 2 times 3 times 3? 2 times 3 times 3 is 18. We do not have that, so let's put the 18 in there as well. And now let's try the four-way combos. 2 times 2 times 2 times 3. 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 is 24. We do not have 24 yet. 24. Um, and let's also try 2 times 2 times 3 times 3. 2 times 2 times 3 times 3. That's uh, 36. We do not have that either. So put 36 in there. And that is all the combinations there are of using these numbers to try to find something new. That's it. We got 12 factors here of 72. Uh, that's quite a lot, but that's all of them. We're, we're done finding them. They are in order a 1, a 2, a 3, 4, skip over 5 and go to 6, 8, 12, 18, 24. You know what? I missed 9. Start over. 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, 9, 12, 18, 24, 36, and 72. That's, uh, that's all of them. So that's the factors of 72. That's a, a tougher one than usual. Uh, if you need more practice, we have a whole bunch of these videos, uh, as well as videos on all uh, concepts of math. Uh, see you all again real soon, guys.